This is the Dayton News Bureau of WHIO, located on the third floor of the Gibbons Hotel. I'm Alan Herbert. I work out of here regularly. This is Howard Miller. He divides his time between this office and the Central News Bureau out at our main studios. With our studios at the edge of the city, we found it wise to maintain this downtown office in order to make the WHIO News Department the most modern in Dayton. Howard, while I step out of the picture for a minute, will you show our visitors the facilities we have here? Certainly, Al. Except for the absence of newswire machines, this is a miniature version of our main newsroom. The Montgomery County Sheriff's Dispatcher is monitored on this shortwave radio here. This is the volume control for this microphone, which we use on our direct broadcast. AM radio receiver, Dayton police receiver. We can make tape recordings either direct or from the telephone on this magna cord. This is our direct line to the studio. And besides these facilities, we also have a portable tape recorder. We carry this portable tape recorder around town and make on-the-spot recordings, which we can either play on direct broadcast or feed back to our main studios on this machine. Thanks, Howard. That's fine. You've seen now the equipment that we have here. But what does all this mean to our news operation? The main thing is our location. It's ideal. The safety building with police headquarters and municipal courts is located just two and a half blocks away. The sheriff's office, county courts, the county government, a half a block away. The city hall is directly across the street. The federal courts are next door. Thus, when we cover our regular downtown beat, we're never very far from this office. We come back here, cover the news of other municipalities in our area by phone, and then we're ready to go directly on the air at noon and at 5.30. This is our way of keeping close touch with the news in downtown Dayton. 